is Queen Nisha, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 3 of season 2 of The Demon Girl Next Door. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. What damn, show me go. <laughs> oh. Yeah, internet. Mm -hmm. Oh, you poor baby. <laughs> this is going to be the best episode ever. Uh, she don't know what Wi-Fi in the internet is. It's so fucking cute. But then it's worse because of the fact is baby's poor. Oh, show me cool, baby. I needed this after the day I had. I mean, my day wasn't really bad. I think we had, like, one little problem. But still, it was a good day. We just hope that tomorrow. Tomorrow is better. But by the time y'all see this, it'll be tomorrow. So, you know, fingers crossed and prayers up that my Friday is good and that I don't have to deal with bullshit customers. Mm-mm. I think she just did the Wi-Fi pasture. That too. Yeah, because we don't want it to look at the naughty stuff. Oh, show me go. So, you know, watch Hulu and everything, yeah. Surfing the net. Ah, yes, Twitter. Yeah, because Shamiko doesn't even have a phone, doesn't she? Damn. Exactly. You need help. I like the way that looks. Kill it. <laughs> no. You never want to show people or even tell people 
what your real name is, where the fuck you live, your address, your social security number, your credit card. You never want to give people that information. Well, you know, when you're on the privacy part, you can do that. But, you know, you got to be a little cautious. We all do it. Or you just go, oh my god, what's the word? What is the word, DJ? I've said the word like a bazillion times. It is still from <laughs> incognito. There we go. Yeah. Hmm? Aww. Learning the web for dummies. <laughs> I'm gonna type it while I'm finger. Oh my god. Did you just already get it a virus or something? Show me, Cole. Oh, the fork, the magic wand. The fact that she's using a picture of her tail as her profile picture for Twitter. <laughs> oh, I love it. Yeah, I mean, but the thing is, why don't you just straight up ask me, well, hey, you using this? If we don't hear the cat speak this season, I'm going to be so pissed. She just wants to, you know, speak to you when you're not here. Damn it, Shamiko. We don't know what we actually want to do. Well, you know, that's what you get. Hard headed. It might be Momo. You have to check it. No, 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 no! That's a typical Twitter conversation.
頑張れ、シャミ子。頑張れ、モモ。お。OK。Of course, you help. Can we kind of talk about how Shamiko's tail is like kind of wrapped around Momo? <laughs> you sure? Are you sure this is a good idea, though? Well, that's still shummy cool. <laughs> no, girl had to pass out due to the, like. <laughs> No, because something tells me, ancestor, you're going to get lost. Right? Same, same, same. A sale, yes. Oh, is it gonna rain? Oh. <laughs> no, show me, go. You sure you don't want to come with? She sure did. Well, yeah, that too. I mean, hey, the outfit is cute, but I thought you would want to go shopping the rest of the day.
Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a lazy day. I mean, it's a, it looks like it's about to rain, bruh. I mean, because you know, but if Shamiko Shamiko was her date and not ancestor Shamiko, Mama would dress up. Mama definitely would dress up. Come on now. <laughs> sure, ancestor. Oh, shit. Mm mm. And how long has it been now? Hmm. Oh, a health spa. Hmm. Hey, it's something better than nothing. Jesus Christ. Oh, damn. I kind of want to go to the gym. Mm-mm. How about let's not and say we did? Mm. Power's gone out. Uh oh. Y'all dropped Shami Cole. No, 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 Lilith, it's okay. Just the power's out. Okay, but Lilith, you, you dropped Shami Cole. Where's Shami Cole? Mm-hmm. Heck, I thought they would be watching random TikTok videos. Oh my god. <laughs> Why did I think for a moment it was Lilith watching Momo's hair?
Yeah, and we go on an actual, actual date. I mean, this was a date, but, you know, not what I was really expecting for a date date between these two. So, we call it a date, but we're friends. Are you going to throw her? Good friends, quote unquote. <laughs> Honestly, that was cute. <laughs> exactly. Especially if it's on Amazon. On Amazon, you always have to pay, 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 pay. It's worse when you have a subscription with them. And the next thing you know, they take your money. You could be at work, and then you get a notification. Oh, such and such and such and such took this much out of your account. You're like, damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Fuck. Because as someone who is a <laughs> Amazon Prime member... And I have, I have my little benefits from it. And then, okay, it's like, okay, what if you want to have, um, because it was funny, I had this conversation with my mom, uh, Wednesday night. So, there's other things, like, you know, like, Hulu, Disney, uh, Netflix, and a whole bunch of other things, right? So, the one thing that I hate about the bundle of Amazon Prime versus the bundle of, like, Hulu and Disney together. Okay, so, like I said, I have Amazon Prime. I have a uh, peacock and I have um HBO Max. All right. So basically, so I have to pay three different prices. So in total like when I cut connect those all together, I'm paying like under almost I think between 30 to 40 dollars, but then you're at, I think yeah, adding everything else like that I do I'm paying like almost 155 dollars for everything. But it's the one thing, because, like, if you look at the the thing that they have with Disney and Hulu, it's a lot cheaper than that. And I freaking hate that. It's so freaking annoying. But I thought the date was cute. I mean, I was expecting them to, like, go somewhere. Not the hell spa again. But, I, I mean, hey, it's okay. You have some good memories. You want to make some more memories. Like, <gasps> there she is! Oh, my God! <laughs> I think Lilith, you know, once again, being in Sean Michael's body... <laughs> I mean, once again, no comment. I, I loved it. I thought it was funny. But of course, like in a nutshell, anytime when I think of it, uh, it, it's just Momo trying to, you know, scheme and blackmail Lilith once again, which she did. I also love the fact that, you know, Shamiko finally got to know what Wi Fi is and experience the internet and such. Because, like I said, as, you know, Mo her family is a poor family, they don't live in the greatest neighborhood and such. So, of course, they just have to do certain things and, you know, hey, I mean, you know, sometimes you can't have, you know, internet, Wi-Fi, TV, but you make everything, you know, as much as you can. It, it is sad, though, because I've met some people who have never really experienced, like, Wi-Fi or even social media. I've met some people who have never had a social media account before, and I'm like, how do you live? And such. So, hell, it was funny because when I was at work on Tuesday... Um, I was listening to the radio and such, and the guy on the radio asked, like, oh, hey, would you ever date somebody that never really uses or even has a social media account? I think I would. I think it would be a very interesting thing because sometimes you want to be very private and not really share, like, every little thing on social media. I mean, like, for me, like, I, okay, like, when I'm on my Instagram, like, the, the biggest app that I, social media app that I use now is freaking Twitter. In the beginning when I got my Twitter, I barely used it. Um, and now I use it way too freaking much. I mean, that is the one place where, like, majority of you guys and all my other subscribers, like, 50 out of 50 follow me. Or if it's, like, I use Snapchat like this. It just depends on my mood. And then same thing with Instagram. Like, if I really want to say, like, oh, hey, let me take a picture of myself. I look cute today. Um, and post it on the internet and such that all my friends and family can see it. Then, yeah, and same thing with my subscribers and such. 
Um, it's just about that connection that you give someone. I, I feel like, you know, because I have such a big following between here and Twitter, of course, people are going, well, I'm not as big on Twitter. I have a bigger following on here than I do on Twitter. Um, people always follow me and, and such. And there, I always think that, like, oh, I'm gonna hit big on Twitter when I can, and it ain't gonna fucking happen. So, I just sometimes will post, like, random edge, or I'll retweet something, or I'll just, like, talk about how I feel, or I'll talk about my day. Pretty much the norm of what everybody typically does on Twitter. Sometimes we'll talk about, like, controversies and just like that, and I do like that. And I love the fact that, you know, with this episode, for those three, um, they all basically messaged each other because then, you know, we all have, like, a little side of DMs that we have of friends and then people who, you know, are just random and they just pop up and they're saying, like, hey. And you're just like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Which is so freaking weird because I've had that happen before and I'm like, who the fuck is this? <laughs> I mean, because the one thing is, I don't think as of now, like, I've, n I, 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 yeah, I don't think I've ever really gotten someone, like, requesting a show in a DM on Twitter. I, typically, it's just like, oh, next thing you know, I get, like, an at and they're like, hey, you seen this? Or I'll get something on uh, freaking YouTube in the comment section. Or, like, with my Patreons, my Patreons will message me and such. Or, like, sometimes if it's, like, like okay, there's one, there's just one show that somebody wants me to watch. Um, and I haven't really told them that I'm going to watch it. But I'm going to basically, like, kind of surprise this person. So, basically, this weekend, if this person is watching this, like, you, you don't even know who this person is so if you think this is you you'll probably find out soon but what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to binge it all this weekend and try to get it out like in the next couple of weeks but yeah I thought that was really sweet um, but I loved it it was so fucking good this week's episode was good especially like I said I needed this after the day I had because it felt like my day went by so freaking slow but slow, so freaking fast at the same time but other than that guys that is my reaction to be towards episode 3 of season 2 of the demon girl next door if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next thursday for episode four bye guys